Hello everyone and welcome to the very first episode of Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 3. It's been a little bit of time since we finished the second one, um, but we're here, so let's go ahead and jump on into it. Uh, I like the loading image for this. I'm not sure if it's PS4 and PS5 that they have that loading image, but it was really nice. Uh, if you're wondering, I already answered this a thousand times, but... I did play the duology for Crossbell. I didn't upload it on the channel because there's no official release and it's a kind of a no intro. There is no intro unless you force it on me through the main story. I don't want to be spoiled on anything. I like the jacket, Reen. Um, what was I saying? I finished, yes, the duology of Crossbell games. I like them. They're good. They're very good games. The, almost every Trails game that I've played has been good. So it would have been a shocker if it wasn't. Backstory. Read about the events. Oh, you mean I could have just read it? Oh, no, it's not here. Uh, that's cool. Do they have this? Wow, they have it. Really? Huh. Anything interesting? Oh, suspicious figures. It's like Kronos. Like, oh, God, no. Uh, okay. That's good. Hey. At least they give you some insight on the Crossbell stuff, right? Huh. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, that's cool. Um, but, yeah, no, I, I like the Crossbell games. I like the little twist in the second one that explains why the intro to the first one was different than the end game kind of deal. They kind of pulled the Crossbell one. Let's just put it at that. I don't know why I'm avoiding spoiling it. In well, then, no, I know why I'm avoiding spoiling it, because it's not games were released in English. Uh, let's jank the, jank, jack the voice up. Uh, is there anything about subtitles? Well, no, these games usually don't have that problem, right? Yeah. Maybe? I don't know. Sure, let's... That saved, right? Alright, cool, cool, cool. Let's, yeah, just start. Uh, normal, hard, or not. We'll do it very easy, of course. No, 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 no. Um, so I played all the other ones on hard. There were some people who were like, yo, the smallest mistake will lead to death. Lovely. There were some other people that were like, hey, the game's extremely easy, even on hard and nightmare. I kind of heard both sides of the story. I'm gonna just stick to hard. Um... It was mentioned that they continue their trend of just healing bosses, which I'm, I'm not a fan of, but apparently it's pretty bad on Nightmare, so we'll just stick to hard for now. You know, I'm sure we'll get one shot when I get overconfident anyways. Uh, if you select hard or Nightmare, you won't be able to choose the weakened enemy or retry option after. Yeah, that's fine. I don't care. I wouldn't have chosen it ever anyways. Are we loading? We're loading. Ooh, I like that loading image. That date would be important if I actually remember the dates of the game. The Airborne Empire, Western Lemaire, something or other. Maybe I should remember dates of the game. <laughs> it probably is important. Former Noble Alliance base. Juno Naval Fortress. Uh, so we got Jaegers, some dogs. I like your swords. I mean, they're not really dogs. They're war dogs. But they're not That's really loud. Save me. <laughs> oh, I surrender. Holy Just crap. Huh, how foolish. <laughs> Left wing, block B intercept. My ears. Now moving to our next area of attack. All right, at least my headphones have like a volume control on it. A oh, hi. Dead soldiers of a dead land, you have proven your pride. The pages are laid bare. It is up to us to pen their contents. Numerous foes approach. Though they aren't who we foresaw, their skills are still worthy of note. Now, 
We shall see if they are worthy of our final experiment as well. Yes, my lord. I actually totally forgot your names. In the name Not Duvali. I remember Duvali. I totally already foes. forgot your names. Yo, Mech! They'll learn what it means to fight us and to come face to face with the strongest in Ouroboros. Hello? So I know you guys are on the cover. Well, most of you are on the cover, I think. L look at that! It's a white ion. That's the successor of the Type Alpha that wiped out Gorilla Fortress. As far as I can tell, it doesn't seem like it's functional at the moment. <laughs> I say we break it down piece by piece. No, I want it! We can waste it before our precious little Ashen Chevalier even has to lift a finger. What about... Have you forgotten our role as the second team? So what? If he's got everyone's attention already, we might as well. Okay. We've got an ace up our sleeve. I'm, I'm, Now's our chance. Is, is this the same thing as the other ones? On you start hound. off like at a scene later in the glory game. Hound. Is that what's going on? He he probably put a lot of thought into this, you know. But it is true he's always rushing off on his own to save the day. Talking about Reen? Damn it! Now that I'm thinking about it, it really pisses me off. Why well, is a protagonist? I do agree to some extent. Uh, I think he's doing a pretty good job, all things considered. <laughs> That's just what a real man is like. He tries to be strict, but melts into being oh so sweet. He'll spend hours caring for you before sparing a second for himself. Someone as dashing yet kind as him would make any girl's heart flutter. This is true, I am pretty amazing. What? Speak for yourself. <laughs> a player as clueless as him is the worst kind. Hmm, yes. Very well put. I feel like I'm being attacked. Harsh words, but he does bring it on himself. Uh, again? They sure like to be flashy. It is the no The intervals are getting shorter. So this is a few years the after the second one, climax. right? I'm assuming... the essence. Okay. Class 7, let's move out! Hi, okay. I'm playing it on the PlayStation, by the way, this time, instead of the PC. So, we'll see if that was a good idea. High speed mode, I gotta press this. Uh, action menu? Assault attack? Challenge to card game, fuck that! Unless they change the COG game and it's good. Because it wasn't good in the other two games. Uh, switch leader, yeah, okay. What is assault attack? <laughs> what does that mean? We'll just we'll just mess with it. A save menu, well, that would be pretty cool when I need the save. Alright, so what is this? How's this? Yeah! Okay. Camera, stop it. Yeah, that, I want to go. I, there we go. Okay. Uh, just revert it anyways. So it's 619. I can't go to my menu. Yeah. Game, you just told me I could go to my menu. What weapons are we my dealing turn. with here? We got the Tonfaz. <laughs> oh, we got two swords. I like that. I'm going. Yeah. We got a rifle. I got this. <laughs> you got an, an axe hellbred thing. All right. My turn. Uh, it's my turn. Okay. Sure. Is, is it... I'm pretty sure that was Altina. Is she not in the party? Here I go. Here I go, I guess. All right, we're going to go down here. Oh, that was the camera. Is there no sprint? Yeah. I mean, I know, I guess Let's we go. are technically running it's already. Turn. It's my turn. Oh, there is. Okay, it's the R1 button. You should have read the menu, Crit. Well, sorry. I kind of zoned out with all the information there. Give me yeah. this. Yeah. Yeah. What the f What is that? I, I missed? We strike. Okay. That did a lot of damage. Oh. Uh. Well, there's Altina, I think. Uh. It's not that different from the menu before. It is actually throwing me for a goddamn loop. <laughs> it's, um. 
Okay, what do we got? We got auto. Nah, I'm good. I mean, yeah, sure. Let's do auto. Oh, wait a minute. That wasn't damage. That was a shield? My turn. Oh. Well, that could be a problem. Crafts. Rain slash. Uh, strike. Okay, and you break. Is this Final Fantasy Thirteen? 13? Alright. Uh, cutie bullet? Shoot through the heart with a charm-filled bullet. Don't look at me like that. I feel very uncomfortable right now. Now's our chance. Uh, Rush. There, Ash. Yeah. Your name's Ash. It's my turn. That's great. Um. No, oh, up here. I gotta, gotta really need to remember that. Uh, Gemini Blast. Excel Breaker? This is it! Huh? One more! I'll finish it. Okay. Excel Breaker! That's cool! Okay. I chose Let's hard, right? Living. This is the intro, I know that, but at the same time. Uh, okay, let's, we got names. We got uh, Juna, Kurt, Muse, Ash, and Altina. Okay, and those are our Master Chords. I recognize... One? <laughs> Two? Maybe? You guys are level 35? Oh man, you guys are way under leveled. Alright, let's go. Oh hi, how's it going? I won't go easy. Uh, I mean, I guess that kinda is my bad. But uh Bilial Raid. Now, let's dance. I ain't done with you yet. It's a sight? Yeah! It's a chain sight! That is not how I was gonna pronounce that or pronounce that. Can I can I have that weapon, please? Very well. Wow, dog, you left two alive. That kind of sucks. Yeah. Sleep wave. No thanks. I have insomnia. It's my turn. Oh, you can reach that one. Yes. Uh. Can we swap? We can swap. Yes. I'll leave it to you. I'll handle it. I know. Attack. There. Let's go. Sure. I will save your S break for later. All right. Yeah. Your voice actress sounds familiar. They always do. Nope. They always do. Every game that I've been playing. It has the same voice actors and actresses. When attack misses, the target will counterattack if the attacker is in range. Okay. And if they aren't in range, fuck them. Ah. Okay, but what is this? Ah. <laughs> I got an ah. antidote. Oh, it auto picks up. That's fantastic. <laughs> that is fantastic. The save point coming up. Hi. How's Let's wipe them out. Triple advantage. I like that. So I don't need to hit them from behind anymore. That's fantastic. You know why? Because in the second game, I couldn't. <laughs> I just couldn't do it. Like I don't. It just wouldn't let me. Um, crafts. Twilight Blade. Do I need to go on another rant about Twilight? I feel like you're gonna make me go on another rant about Twilight. Uh, Twilight Blade. Hold the fuck up. Go. No, I need to go back. I mean, sure. You have a heal. Neat. Just punch them. Yeah. I'm pretty sure, sure. it said Twilight Blade when I was looking at it. Unbound Rage. What do you, what do you mean? 
Cause the, yeah, I mean, right. the damage is so low. <laughs> Um, yeah, the damage is Very so well. low. No, I just said twi Twilight Blade. Really? My my brain was like, it's Twilight. I mean, that's maybe how you pronounce it, but Blade Dance? Oh, it's a buff? Uh, pushes power past human limits, but at a price. What is it, like, lower my health after a few turns? Probably. That's almost a certainly how it happens. Um... I just keep attacking, I guess. There. Assist. It's mine. My turn. Yeah, no. Oh, you can't hit multiple now. Oh, yeah, you can. There. There. Uh, rush. Ash now. Got it. <laughs> Overkill. Break. My turn. His turn. Yeah. It's down. I'll assist. This is it! Oh, that's fantastic. Let's go. At least we're kicking these guys' asses. I wanted to check the difficulty again. It's my turn! Why do you care? It's at the beginning of the game, Kratos. <laughs> like, I know, but at the same time, okay. even in the Let's intros for the other ones at hard, it kind of kicked my ass for the most part. Uh, oh, but we can't. Oh, yes, we can. Wait a minute. I thought you said square was the menu, weirdos. Uh, option. It's on hard. Okay. Maybe I should have chose Nightmare. We'll see. Um, I just don't want to get into a point where I can't change it later on, and it's like bosses are healing and yeah. one-shotting me. Locked and, and loaded. If this game was like, well, I know it's not, but if this game was like 30 hours long, I'd probably feel more comfortable at doing that, since I wouldn't be too amiss yeah. to having to redo it yeah. <laughs> if that was Locked the case if I got loaded. stuck. But since this game is probably 100 hours long, which means the episodes are going to be about 45 minutes plus, um, yeah, I would not want to have to restart if I get stuck anywhere. Because that would be insane. It would it would actually be, if I got stuck somewhere and I couldn't get past it because I was on nightmare mode, it would actually be the end of the series. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. Maybe 4 we'll try Nightmare. If they... Don't bring back boss healing. Well, I don't know why you're covering up the names now. They're huge. Thanks. Cutting edge machines employed by the Stall Ritter. One thing after another. What kind of circus is this? An extravagant one with a high price for admission. Class 7, our goal is to eliminate these targets. Fire up those combat links. We got work to do. All right. Yeah. yeah. Boss time? This one might be you have no, no. Crap. Well, I didn't want you to get the critical there. Behold, the dual blades of Vander. Oh, uh, you. Uh, are you? I lend it. Are you Vander, or are you like just a member of their school? Ragnar, strike! That was sure. not a lot of damage. But Zero Arts? May as well use this because we took some damage. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. You're welcome. Thanks. Here I go. Alright, let's see. Defense and speed down. That's pretty good. You can't escape. Fire! Wide open. It's mine. Now. Now, detector. This gets double the defense down, right? Oh, the defense down didn't hit the left one. Brianna, That's bullshit. Fire. <laughs> oh, she was frozen today. I got this. That's great for you. Are your defenses lowered? No, they restored. God damn it. Your CP's not at 200, so we're going to wait a little bit, and you just attack, I guess. Yeah. It's down. We'll burst. We'll wait for burst. I'll assist. That shit on free. Yeah. Very well. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll focus fire for now. My turn. 
Jesus. <laughs> Altina, come on. <laughs> uh. Sure. All right. Um. Get hit it. Ooh, Altina's almost at 200, actually. Yeah. I'll assist. And she's at 200 right now, actually. He, there's a good. there's a crit coming. Uh, can I heal? Holy breath. Arcus, activate. Huh. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Now. All right, now you punch this one, there. and then you do well that, now. I guess, and then you do it's that. And you get a crit. And then you kill everyone! Now, transform! Sync complete. Go, Arcadius Gear! What? Ready, launch! Brianna, open fire! I hit both of them, right? Exterminating target! Huh? Ah! Oh, that's just beautiful. I got this. That's just fantastic. Why are you still alive? Yeah. All right. Okay, so who has? Yeah. Oh, burst. Everyone ready? Leave it I'm to me. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. You're alive. You're alive. No, you hey. should be dead. It's mine. Thank you for being dead. Yeah, we did it. Indeed. Good work. Now I'm getting a level sword breaker too, electric boogaloo. Ah, uh, crap. Oh, uh, is that going to be a running theme in this game as well? Stand back. Clumsileus. Thanks. That was a close one. Oh, X. <sighs> Thanks, Allie. And Sammy, too. You're welcome. However, the name's Sammy. <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping we would have a minute to ourselves. Nah, we're too popular. <laughs> huh. So you sensed us coming. The Stall Ritter. The stout and the sharp. Hello. We meet again, children of class seven. I didn't think you'd make it all this way on your own. I mean, to be fair, the enemies aren't that bad. Do you intend to overcome certain death without the Ashen Chevalier? <laughs> Cute. Now cut the shit. We know how much stronger than us you are, but we refuse to stand by as you do your bidding. I respect that fire. I will give you my utmost in battle. All right. You'll do as a delectable appetizer before the main course. Oh, no. Okay. Show me your strength. I would have saved my CP. Handle this. Yeah. Oh, that's not that bad. That's a little worse. Very well. Um. Okay. Let's see. How are we doing on CP? We're oh, we're close. Maybe. You do holy breath and Arcus, heal up. Because I like them healing. Now. Uh, attack? Uh. Oh shit, what the hell is your name actually? Sure. Uh, what the hell is that on your health bar? An exclamation point? Enos. The stout. Enya? Sure, that makes sense. Was that different <laughs> in the trench? Maybe that was the same. This one, yes, I recognize. This one... I don't recognize. I'm bad with names anyways. Zero Order. I don't know what the hell that is. What the hell is that? What is Zero Order? Oh, Order. What's Order? What the hell is this? Excuse me? Absolutely. 
absolute reflect four turns? Delay minus 70? Break damage? I don't really care about that. That Okay, so... Uh, hmm. Let's go with Absolute Reflect. Let's go, Evan Crest. My turn. I know. What other orders do we have? Oh, we can't. Okay, that's fine. So I can only have one order going at once? So in four turns, I can do another one? Okay, no, that's great. It's down. I'll assist. Yeah, that's not gonna affect the magic, right? Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, good. Yeah. Oh, but it's for the whole party. All right. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So it's yeah, not as yeah. broken as I thought it was. Pretty close, though. <laughs> Pretty close, though. Ooh, yeah. but it does do that. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, so it's just party turn. Okay. Uh. My turn. Uh, order. We need three BP for this. And then when I get 200. Very well. CP. Uh. It's gonna be great. Uh. Ow. It's my turn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Very well. I'm gonna heal again because I don't like damage. Uh, you might die. We need a break. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I'll assist. Now order. Crazy hunt. Go wild. Crazy hunt. Now. Uh, and then attack. There. And then do that. Now, let's dance. This is plus 50% crit, right? I ain't done with you yet. Yeah! Any other buddy? June is almost at 200. How much damage? I have a feeling they're not actually dead, even though they disappeared into the ether. That's some delicious damage. What do you mean, enhance? What do you mean, evil eye? Thank you. you know what? Thanks. Screw you. Chronos, are you spamming your S graphs? Yes. Yes, I am. Because I want to see what that exclamation point does. One more. I'll finish it. Where do you load the ammo for these? I feel like it's like. Oh, you broke. Oh, you broke. Behold, <laughs> you broke. Of Vander. Now. Uh, I'll end it. So this would do a lot of damage to a broken person, right? Is that how that works? Strike. Also sounds extremely dark when you say it that way, Kronos. Yes, I, I, I'm aware. It did like no damage to her. My turn. Why did it do no damage? There. I, mean, I did a lot there. more damage. It's mine. Oh, uh, okay. So that's just where the battle ends. <laughs> what fun! Indeed, they have quite a bite to them. <sighs> They're acting like we're nothing to them. No, you get used to it. No, you don't. You still get freaking blindingly mad every time this happens. It's better to assume they're conserving their energy. Why the hell are you two playing around? Stop wasting time before our main enemy shows up. Ah, you're here early. And so ends our fun. That's the head knight of the stall ritter. Duvali the Swift. She'll be trouble. <laughs> She may be kind of a ditz, but she's fast. Who, who are you calling a ditz, <laughs> cocky little hatchling? 
I do like your sword. Ines, Anea! We'll put a stop to them with our radiant star formation! Very well. Like, I recognize the look for Anea. I don't recognize the name, though. <laughs> don't hate us for what's about to happen. I mean, they looked a little... The bow looks familiar. They look different in Crossbell, like, obviously. But still. It's just like before. That the best you got? Bring it on! He says, bleeding internally. Prepare for- Trouble and make it double? Not so fast. Oh, hey, Sarah. Goodness! Sooner than we expected. We made it. Excuse us. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How am I not surprised? Told you, <laughs> glory hound. <sighs> Instructor. Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to be in the left wing? I guess, I don't know. <laughs> the paths meet up here, so we decided to see how things were going for you. You sound <laughs> different. Seeing all the paths firsthand, I understand why they call this fortress impregnable. Leave them to us. Why is every fortress impregnable there. in this see game? See you again at the tower. In the series, as I say. Yes, Instructor. Thank you. <sighs> Fine. Just be careful. Like every game, there's like, oh, this pre this fortress is impregnable. <laughs> Charging headfirst into your graves, are you? Don't say I didn't warn you. If you're insistent on challenging our lord, I will cut you down right here and now. Two arms, class seven, ashen chevalier. Are we fighting? This intro is going on pretty long. Oh, there's gonna be an actual intro now, okay. A new tale of the Eborian Empire. It's like, just kidding, and it's tra Trails in the Sky starts up again. So there's definitely flashes of the first and second game here. Uh, yes, that is Reen, you're right. Juna Crawford, okay. Kurt Vander, so you are Vander. Only Altina, I don't know why I called you Alina. Uh, Muse Agret, Agret? Oh, Fee, you got long hair now. Oh, Mi Emma, you look fantastic. Oh man, they don't get their pictures, huh? Oh, Toa! Hey, Tina! Oh, uh, okay. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Claire. I don't know who the right one was. Yeah, uh... Uh... Wait. No, go back. <sighs> oh, Shirley. Okay. Ooh, I don't like the fact that I saw Sharon standing there with them. I know she's part of Ouroboros, but I really hope we don't have to fight her. Uh, that's cool seeing Tita and a guy who I'm sure is probably pronounced Agate or something like that. Uh, can we go back? What was his name? It was like, was it, was it Azure Siegfried or Sigward? Azure Onion Knight? Um, so at first we saw like, 
the back of a character holding two guns, I'm like, oh, it's okay. That, that kind of looks like the silhouette of Crow. I mean, from the first game, anyways. And then we saw Azure to uh, Sigford, whatever his name is. Um, his hair looks very familiar, and the mask is such a fucking JRPG trope that I'm really hoping that is not who I think it is. Because that's... One, extremely stupid to show that off in the intro like that. And two, such a fucking cop-out. Like, such a cop-out. Save, sure. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna ignore that for now. And pretend I never, like, I never saw it. Three months earlier, okay. We're in March? That's right, right? January, February, March? Yeah. One of my freaking elementary school? How'd I forget that? It is nice being back in 3D land. The next stop is Leaves. Leaves. We will be stopped for... Is that Anton? No, that's Reen. That's a lot of kids. <laughs> that was a lot of kids. Reen, why do you have so many belts? You have like one around your waist and one on your leg? That like a garter belt? I mean, yeah, you do you. Don't really need a garter belt though, on the outside. It is a JRPG, so I guess that wouldn't be the first time you saw a garter belt on the outside. But it is only on one leg. How good can that possibly be? Why aren't we just riding? <laughs> Why aren't we just riding Valamir? Valamar, whatever. Eat my call, Valamar. Yeah, I get it. Have we nearly arrived? Maybe. Yeah. Oh, this is Reen? Oh my god. Sorry you had to be cooped up in Gorelia Fortress this past month. And I'm sure this isn't exactly a first-class cabin either. It's pretty tight in here. <laughs> Not to worry. This is something that needed to be done. While resting, the drain on my energy is insignificant. Besides, if it will reduce the burdens you shoulder, I am more than happy to comply. Cool. <laughs> you know... I'd think there was a human in there if I didn't already know that was you talking. Thanks, Velomar. You are welcome. Mm, is this it? Aha, uh -huh. sure is. <sighs> For crying out loud. I don't know what all the fuss is about. Do they really need us to supervise unloading this junk? Sure, because I it's probably important, right? Huh? Picture that going through a landing port. Wow. I know, it's pretty right. It's pretty great, right? I'd heard about him, but seeing one up close is wild. What are you two doing here? Wonder what they're doing here. Exactly, right? A seven arge tall humanoid weapon. How do you pronounce that? Arge? Panzer Soldats or something, yeah? No, I don't think now, so. Now, this one's special. Oh, this is the Ashen Knight, isn't it? Get out of here. Yeah, you're exactly right. I wouldn't have expected a civilian to know that, much less someone from outside Erebonia. <laughs> Let's just say I'm a little interested in things like that. She is a mech nerd, so she's awesome. You stay the fuck away from Maureen. I swear to God. <laughs> a you two have got... Your whole family goes nuts for this kind of stuff. But how'd you know we're not from around here? You have just the tiniest sliver of an accent. Really? I'm guessing you're from somewhere down south? Liberal, maybe? Is it that easy to tell? 
Bingo. So what? That makes you the Ashen Chevalier? It, yeah, I'm surprised you knew that too. Oh, he's a bracer. Um... <sighs> Schwarzer, are you back oh, here? Oh, God. Yes, it's Patrick. Wait, was that him in the the seat? We'll be arriving in five minutes. Are you prepared? Hmm? All set. I'm good to go whenever. Sorry for holding you up. We gotta get ready ourselves. That's right. Thanks for talking with us. Who are those two? They didn't appear to be your everyday civilians. Oh, no. They're from Liberal. I guess they're getting off soon, too. Something tells me I'll be seeing more of them at my new job. Yeah, probably. They were in the title screen. They're also kind of main characters from other games. Oh, is that so? I admit, I have heard the rumors. What rumors? You can't just leave me there, game, with I heard the rumors. You can't tell me the rumors. Now arriving at Does she have her station. oral gear thing? Leave station. Is it still overpoweredly we will be broken? Stopped for 10 minutes to unload cargo. Cuz that would be sweet. Also, I don't remember leaves. Is that a new place? Or should I be worried about my memory finally going? It would appear little has changed. The Ashen Knight is as beloved by the masses as ever. Good. Bow before me. Well, I uh, tried to lay low this past year. I've turned down all the interview requests I've been bombarded Why? with. Why? Why? Let them worship you, Reen! It's little wonder, then. For a young hero like yourself, such actions only serve to grant you an irresistible air of mystery. The rumors of your role in the Northern War have, by this point, far outstripped the truth. Good! <sighs> My apologies. That was a regrettable slip of the tongue. No, it's all right. It's just something I'll have to deal with. Thank you, Patrick. For the last year, no, last two years, you've helped me out more times than I can count. Well, that was sudden. Yeah, I don't know what the hell he's talking about. <laughs> I have simply been performing my duty as a member of the glorious Class One. Of course I could spare some consideration for a hapless classmate with barely enough attendance to graduate. We still in school? Is that true? One who has unreasonable tasks thrust upon him on a near daily basis, yet somehow manages to triumph regardless. And you said I was sudden. You're serving as the deputy of the Marquis's family in Ortis now, right? I'm sure that's no walk in the park either, but I know you'll give it everything you've got. But of course, there's no way I can allow us to fall behind House Alborea. I recommend you do the same for whatever may come at your unique new workplace. Are we not with the military anymore? And. Seeing as she is not so terribly far, do be sure to keep in touch with Lady Elise. Perhaps you might even Oh, absolutely not. Word. Thanks again for all your help, Patrick. But that's an entirely different matter. Just pans the camera back and he's just holding <laughs> Patrick's just severed arm. <sighs> Take care. Hope to see you again soon. Indeed. Indeed! You look like Anton, Patrick. Oh yes, it nearly slipped my mind. About that pledge Class 7 made one year ago. I hope to see it come to fruition. Okay. Oh. What's the pledge? I kind of expected like a few year time skip, and if I knew the dates, I probably would have known how many years it's actually been since the second game. But if we're still in school, that's absurd. Reen, have we been 
I know we had yeah. military duty. I hope so too. But they all graduated like at the end of their first year, right? We can't still be in school. Prologue, spring once again. Well, here I am. Okay. Where's, where's here? What, where's leaves? What is leaves? So a dormitory leaves Heimdall suburbs. Okay. I've never been to the suburbs west of Heimdall before. Or the west of Heimdalls. All right. Almost reminds me of Trista. <laughs> there are even Lino flowers blooming here. For a second there, I thought they were going to be like, oh, this is Trista, but the name changed for some reason. That outfit of Emma's is actually fantastic. <laughs> Over there. Trista. The, the fancy get, get up. And the academy. I wonder how everyone who's still there is doing. And how Principal Van Dyke is after he returned to active duty. He returned to active duty? The old dude? I never would have dreamed something like that would happen. That must be it there. I can tell it's brand new even from here. They said they'd take Valimar to the hangar on site. Okay. Reen? Oh? Uh huh? Oh, it's Toa. Look down. Look down. <laughs> it really is you, Rain. Wow. The magazines don't do you justice. You look so mature now. Did you get taller, too? I almost didn't recognize you. Uh, Toa? Oh, did you not recognize me? No, either? you look exactly the same. The outfit is fantastic, though. <laughs> I definitely haven't gotten taller, but I'm hoping my new work uniform adds some womanly charm. Max charms that. Absolutely. Oh, or maybe shows that my figure's filled out a little bit. It more. hasn't, but I'll lie to you. Uh, hold on. Hmm? It's just... Uh, well, we haven't seen each other in a while, and I could never get a hold of you. And you are the one, like, person that I, like, final, like, a bonding event each time. Couldn't transfer the data. That's why I'm playing on a different console system anyways. Then you just show up out of nowhere, dressed for work, in the same town I'm about to start work? Are you stalking me? Because I'm fine with that. Just maybe don't be crazy, please. Well, if you're stalking me, that's probably... <laughs> I never imagined we'd end up working at the same place. I'm perfectly fine with that. Sorry, I didn't mean to surprise you. I thought you already knew. I know nothing. Well, a lot happened before graduation. And after it. I'm sure you've heard all about it. Of course. It was actually one of the reasons I decided to come here. But it sure was a nice surprise to hear you'd be joining me. Same for me. Well, anyway... Congratulations on graduating, Rain. Thank you. I'm sure there are plenty of other people who want to say that to you. Are they all here? Is that going to be wildly too convenient? But I figured I'd do it before anyone else. Thanks, Toa. Uh, wait, do you want something more professional, like Ms. Herschel now? Or Miss Mrs. Swarzer? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Toa is just fine. Remember what I said when we first met? There's no need for formalities with me. Miss Herschel is awfully tempting, though. <laughs> she hasn't changed a bit. So, Toa, you've been here a little while now, right? What's her new workplace like? Hmm. Well, I'm sure they told you a bunch of different things when you accepted your position. No one has told me goddamn anything. But I think 
this job is going to turn out to be a lot more difficult than you expect. Will it? I've been mentally preparing myself for the worst. I just hope I'm ready. Have you already met all of our colleagues? Yes, Do they suck? We've all met. You're the last to arrive. I'll introduce you to them. But brace yourself, okay? <laughs> I feel like the butterflies in my stomach have turned into stampeding rhinociders. Sure. Let's go with that reference. It, it's okay. I'm in the same boat as you. Let's work together as fellow graduates of Thor's and get through this. <laughs> Roger that. Oh, we're here. So is this like Thor's two electric boogaloos? Thor's Military Academy Branch Campus. The color's different, but it's nice they kept the horned lion crest. Mm-hmm. This is the main entrance to our new workplace. Am I the janitor here? Welcome, Reen. To the newly established Thor's Military Academy Branch Campus in Leeds. Are all the other people here, too? Also, I'm tickled that Toe was the first person we saw from the old games. Aside from Patrick, he doesn't count, though. I didn't date him. Well, technically, we didn't date Toe either, but we had very close bonding, goddammit. That is a nice little park area. Where can I fish? That's the most important part. Tactical conference room. In school? <laughs> I know it's a military academy, but... It was Randy. Randy Schwarzer, welcome. I am Michael Irving of the Railway Military Police. I don't remember if we've actually met you. Ranch campus though it may be. Sorry. I'll do my utmost to serve as <laughs> chief instructor. My... My brain power is not really good enough for even main characters, man. If you were a minor character, it's long gone. <laughs> well, well. Lucky me. Didn't expect to run into such a celeb at a place like this. I'm not calling you Randolph. I'm calling you Randy. Name's Randolph Orlando. Got transferred here from the Imperial Army Crossbell Unit. I've been hearing your name all over lately. Pleasure to finally meet the man himself. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I don't know if the voice fits. Reen. I'm Reen Schwarzer. Just a rookie who recently graduated from Thor's main campus. Pleased to meet you, Major Irving, First Lieutenant Orlando. Likewise. It's an honor to be able to work with the famous Ashen Chevalier. But keep in mind, we're not looking for heroics from Divine Knights here. Are you gonna get him? We're only interested in your aptitude as an instructor. Oh, yeah, that's right. They did call me an instructor in the intro, didn't they? Understood. He's from the Railway Military Police. I certainly didn't expect to find a ranking officer like him working here. Not to mention... That look tells me you know a bit about my sordid backstory. Been peeking through the Intelligence Division's files, I take it. Yes, I can't deny it. It's not the first ex Jaeger you've met, dog. From what I could tell, it was a pretty complicated situation that sent you here. <laughs> not as complicated as yours, I'm sure. Anyway, all of us instructors are here now. Major, Instructor Randolph, I'm looking forward to working with you. Wait, there's only four of us? We're the only teachers here? Indeed. I'm curious to see what you'll bring here. Especially after you turned down a position with us. I've been curious as to why. <laughs> uh, so you knew about that? Oh, that's so? You must be better than you look for the RMP to roll out the red carpet. She's the best? I heard you graduated early. What are you, like 17 or something? No, she's like... Actually, you were in your 20s, right? At the last part of the game? Um... Actually... 
I'm 21. Okay, so I guess you weren't in your 20s before. What? Nah, -uh. you're seriously only three years younger than me? She's tiny. Four instructors. That's about what I was expecting, honestly. Really? Because I wasn't! Are we going to teach the entire curriculum among us, though? Correct. There aren't many students, but it will still require great work on our part. This school is already understaffed. It's four instructors? Training, lectures, all manner of miscellaneous tasks. We will, however, receive assistance from the special advisor and the principal. We have a special advisor? We have a principal? Then what's our principal like? Well, let's just say that out of all the people in this great big empire, I never thought I'd meet someone quite as intense as our principal. Really? Uh, try not to be too shocked, okay? I'm ready for anything. You've actually met her before, Reen. Thank you for waiting. Oh. Speak of the devil? I don't remember your name. I know we just saw Thank it you for coming. in the intro, but like you had like two parts in the second game, and I completely just blanked out here. You're the dude that helped me with the sword in the second game, right? Hmm. Whatever is that slack-jawed expression for? That's a G. Smith. Schmitty, as we like to call him. I believe we met during the Civil War. Oh, have you already forgotten my face? Not that I give a whit either way. <laughs> whit? Uh, no, of course not. It's good to see you again, Professor Schmidt. I've always appreciated how you helped me with Valimar's Tachi. As I said before, save it. Though my title is Special Advisor, I plan to focus only on my research. Well, you sound completely useless and should be fired then. Do endeavor to make yourself useful to me, Schwarzer. Or should I say, Ashen Awakener. This is Ashen Chevalier. <laughs> <sighs> he was one of Professor Epstein's disciples, right? Or maybe not. We sure he ain't some faker? Uh, no, he's the real deal. Hey, you two, you're not whispering. You're actually talking really loudly. <sighs> I'm starting to understand why I got hired here in the first place. I never imagined I would meet you here. Oh, it's been about half a year, hasn't it, Schwarzer? Well, since we've all gathered, allow me to say a few words about myself. Cool, start with your name, because I actually have just completely blanked on it. Please pronounce that, because I am illiterate. During the Civil War, I was the general of the defeated Noble Alliance. Yes, I'm aware. I then oversaw the Northern War, resulting in the annexation of North Ambria. But you may think of me as Aurelia Le Guin, principal of Thor's branch campus. <laughs> Reen? All that packed into one woman. Guess it's not so crazy for you to be here after all, eh, Major? Hmm. <laughs> uh, principal Le Guin, it's time. Shall we proceed? Yes, let's begin. Herschel, gather up our fledglings and bring them to the grounds. Y yes, ma'am. I'll see you soon, Rain. All right, bye. Bah. Don't you All buy right. her. Let's see what kind of guys. I'll put you in the goddamn media. ground, Smitty. Schwarzer, see to it you aren't late. L late? To what? To our entrance ceremony, of course. What? I had no idea. Sounds like they weren't very good at telling you what your job was going to be. That would be because we set the date and time without telling you. So you guys are all a bunch of assholes. You'll even be meeting your fledglings there. Exciting, no? Show them what it means to be the Ashen Chevalier. It's starting to seem like the rumors about this place being difficult weren't exaggerations. All right, then. I should probably put these on. Put what on? Glasses? <laughs> Why? Do you need glasses now? Or are you just putting them on because you're a teacher? That's very weird, dog. I <laughs> it's just weird. 
is Tita. She's not in her school uniform, like, at all. I like the lady with the blue hair, though. That's very nicely done. The green-haired one looks like she should be an axe-wielding JRPG character. That's Princess Leia wannabe. Hi, Altina. The guy behind you is a serial killer. She's also a serial killer, but the one that stalks the boy she likes. Oh, that woman. Isn't she the Golden Rakshasa? And that black-haired guy. Pretty hot, right? Oh, he's super famous. Huh, it's him. Oh, X. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> oh, dear. How unexpected. The Ashen Chevalier. No way. Yes way. Are you related to the George guy behind her? Hmm. <laughs> What? What? That girl is... Altina. Attention! I will have silence! Or you will die! We will now begin the entrance ceremony for Thor's Military Academy's branch campus. The opening speeches will be omitted. We will begin by announcing class assignments. First, Class 8, Combat Tactics. The instructor is Randolph Orlando. Oh, X. Right. Step forward when I call your name. Jessica, Wayne, Sydney, Maya, Ash, Freddy, Gustav, and Leonora. You eight. Gustav? What is this? <laughs> Saga Frontier 2? Next, Class 9, Military Finance. The instructor is Toa Herschel. Um... I'll call out names now. Sandy, Kyrie, Tita, Louise, Tatiana, you got a lot of students. Valerie, Muse, Pablo, and Stark. Oh, that's Muse, there are nine all right. of you in total. <laughs> that guy is seriously going to kill people. In class nine. Combat tactics and military finance. Then the ones left over are. Silence! <laughs> we will now have a word from our principal. Principal, if you would. Huh. I am Aurelia Le Guin, principal of the branch campus. As some of you are new to Erebonia, not all of you may be familiar with my name. That, however, is of little concern to me. A few of you may have noticed already, but I'll spell it out for the rest. This school is a trash bin. I mean, fair. We only got four instructors. Huh? Hmm. <laughs> Thor's main campus will be welcoming the Crown Prince this year. As such, it will go through heavy reform. This campus is a place they can toss aside those deemed too troublesome or those with problematic backgrounds. He does not have a problematic background. Just like that, all of you, our instructors, and even myself, are here because we have been tossed aside. You take that back. Toa should not have been tossed aside. <sighs> hey, now. You're a rock star. Uh, Principal Le Guin, that is far too... However, there is a saying. Be ever vigilant as though the world is a battlefield. That does explain the two serial killers, though. Such a mindset is difficult to learn in times of peace. However, the situation we find ourselves in is a perfect environment for it. Those who lack the resolve to better themselves, to reforge themselves in the fires of adversity, leave now, or you run the risk of leaving later in Adios's arms. Rain just walks away. <laughs> I'm leaving. In that case, 
I welcome each and every one of you to Thor's Military Academy's branch campus. Arise, O oh youth, and become the foundation of the world. Or else. I greet you with these familiar words from Emperor Dreykels. So, I only get three students? But in the intro, there was a lot more than three. Well, I'm nice and overwhelmed now. Just where are we supposed to go? <sighs> General, um, principal. Could I get you to announce the final class? <sighs> huh? Very well. We'll be picking up after the main campuses, classes one through six, with our own classes seven through nine. Okay. The three of you make up class seven, special operations. Your instructor will be him, Reen Schwarzer. Do we not teach math or like history or anything else here? I know it's a military academy. I'm pretty sure at Thor's they add that other stuff. Also, I'd like a save point now. Why? Why is Tina here? Wasn't she in in Toa's class? Or did I imagine that? I looked over the blueprints, but I didn't think it'd be this big. Don't get so excited. This facility is nothing remarkable. I'm an asshat. As I explained before, much of your duties will be performed here under my direction. I expect nothing short of raw talent from a Russell. Uh, yes, sir. So, she's a student here after all. I could swear I've heard the name Russell somewhere before. Trails in the sky. But more importantly... What? That we're class seven is clearly no coincidence. Only three students, and she's one of them. Combat tactics and military finance are undergoing their orientations at the moment. Special operations will be having an orienteering exercise. You must make it through this facility in one piece. Okay. In one piece? What does that mean? It means today's your last day! What is this building for? Saving, it's hopefully. Einhell Keep. It was built in conjunction with the branch campus for testing new methods of training. The interior is fully controllable via orbital technology and features variable difficulty levels. As for your exercise, you will be combating monsters and such unleashed within the keep. What? M monsters? That's a joke. I mean, right? not really. You should have heard what happened in the other school. No, I understand. Special operations, indeed. I guess this is a fitting enough exercise, given our class's name. And it's not just for my students, either, is it? It helps that you're quick on the uptake. That said, don't assume it will be the same as the Class 7 you were part of. Rather than an experimental clash between social classes, this one will act as an established task force for assignments in the field. And as its instructor, you will have your students see each assignment through. It's all starting to come together. <laughs> Hold on just a second. We did what you said and came here. But what the heck is all this crap? This is just... I mean, no one ever told me I was being put in some shady black ops squad. Oh, you get used to it. Your placement in Class 7 is the result of your aptitude test, Cadet Crawford. If you are dissatisfied, you have the option to pack your bags and return to the Military Police Academy. <laughs> That's all the way in Crossbell. I've yet to accept the situation, but I understand it now, at the very least. Can you give us more details? Certainly. Instructor Schwarzer and the three of you will enter the keep and stand by for further instructions. 
Thank you. Don't I already have Follow one of these? Stand by. They will explain their qualifications as you brief them on the use of the Arcus 2. Understood. Bah. Finally, we can begin the trial. Disciple candidate, don't dawdle. Everything must be up and running in ten minutes. Yes. Why do I have to do this? I'm the teacher. Why don't I have more students? Damn. Looks like this school's even more messed up than I'd heard. I'd prefer if non-affiliates stayed off the premises. <laughs> Take it easy. I ain't here to cause trouble. Yet. As soon as she's done with her orientation, I'm getting the hell out of here. Very well. You may have been referred here by the royal family, but don't forget your place. This is above you. That extends to any actions you and your friends will take in the Empire from here on out. <laughs> I'd say that's up to you guys, you know? You got a whole country up to its neck in plots and schemes, and then a screwed up school like this pops up out of nowhere. Really makes you wonder who's pulling the strings around here. I can take a guess. I suppose I should have expected as much from an A rank bracer. Oh, did you get promoted? Were you a B rank bracer? Oh, was that at the end of Trails in the Sky? Did you get promoted then? I think. Maybe. It's been a while. A lot of information in my brain just goes away. A facility full of untested mechanisms certainly sounds like a playground for the professor. So how much do you already know? Nothing too specific. The above ground portion is a cube measuring 50 arch on each side, and the below ground area is still being expanded. Hmm? Are the two of you already acquainted? Yeah. We are. I just had no idea she'd be one of my students. But that's neither here nor there. Let's start with introductions while everything's being prepped. I just got here earlier today, so I'm sorry I haven't had time to speak with you two yet. I'm... <sighs> Why even bother introducing yourself? Oh, we're gonna get along just fine, I, I take it. Uh, because it's the fucking nice thing to do! We all know you're Reen Schwarzer, the Ashen Chevalier. The big hero who put an end to the Erebonian Civil War when he was just a student. Not to mention the occupation of Crossbell. I'm sure everyone in Erebonia knows who you are. Probably everyone in Crossbell. Yeah, I probably hate you too. <sighs> in addition, you resolved incident after incident across the Empire as part of your schoolwork. Then, during the Northern War last October, you worked alongside General Le Guin and Brigadier General Bardius to annex. That was the guy North with the spear, Andrew. right? Le Guin? Like, our principal? No, different lady. Wait, what? And he helped occupy North Ambria? That's erroneous. The actual circumstances were... You're both very well informed. Though, calling me a hero... Oh, uh, judging by the look on much. her face, dog, I don't think she's calling you a goddamn hero. I'd still like to say a little bit about myself. As you know, I'm Reen Schwarzer. I'm a graduate of Thor's Military Academy's main campus. I got my diploma just last month, and I'm starting as an instructor here at the branch campus today. So there was two years. Okay. So it's only been two years since the... the end of the second game? I'll be overseeing martial arts and panzer soldat training outside the classroom. Inside the classroom, I'll be teaching history. Okay. That is, of course, in addition to being the homeroom teacher for Class 7 Special Operations. So we're Sarah. Uh, hate to inform you this, Reen, but you have to dress like Sarah now. I'll go next. My name is Kurt Vander. I'm from the capital. I've heard more than just the common stories about you. You're a Vander? That would make you General Zex and Lieutenant Colonel Mueller's... Mueller is my older brother, and Zex really? is my uncle. Really? Okay. 
Though I'm aware I look nothing like them. Right up to my hair. Yeah. Is your dad the mailman? It's true, he doesn't have dark hair or even a similar build. His dad's the mailman. By the way, are those glasses fake? Yeah, I don't know why he's wearing them. They don't look good on you at all. You should probably get rid of them. Oof. <laughs> Dude, I'm with you. I don't know why he's wearing glasses. Fashion is clearly not their intended function. <sighs> all right, I get it. They don't look good. No need to rub it in. Nice to meet you, Kurt. You're up next. <sighs> Fine. Oh, brother. I'm Una Crawford. I Juna? transferred here from the Crossbell Police Not Academy. Juna? What about Juno? Is it Uno? No, it's not Uno, okay? Right? The movie's not called Uno, right? Shit. Is it called Uno? Fuck. And honestly, I'd rather not be here. But if that's how it's gonna be, then I'll just have to make the most of it. Ah. Crossbell. I had my suspicions. What, from the dagger she's been staring at you? So, when you say police academy, you're talking about the military police academy, right? Didn't... didn't Irvine say that? There was no military slapped on the name before the annexation. You guys are the ones who changed it. Are you saying I can only call it by the official name the great and powerful Erebonia has blessed it with? No, that's... Not what I meant. Sorry. I was being insensitive. This is gonna be... gonna be hell, isn't it, Rain? <laughs> well, I might have overreacted. But I still don't accept that name. Yeah. That's completely understandable. Hmm? I'm less than. Altina Orion. Formerly part of the Imperial Army's Intelligence Division. Uh, uh... Isn't that classified? Yeah, well, Million wasn't much better at keeping classified information either. My affiliation with them ended upon my enrollment here. On paper. <laughs> but not in actuality! Please, think nothing of it. I feel as though I've just heard something I shouldn't have. Probably. The Intelligence Division is pretty hardcore, isn't it? Hold up! What do you mean, on paper? It means you're still working for him. Slip of the tongue. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> There's that snark. Thank you for waiting. Hi, Tita. Preparations are now complete for the level zero Einhell trial. If you haven't already, please set your Arcus 2s now. I would love to save, actually. Is that the girl from earlier? I was under the impression she was a student, like us. Understood. Give us just a moment. And a save point. Each of you were given one of these, right? It's fancier looking. Ah, that. I was sent one, but I haven't turned it on yet. It's a battle orbment. Normal battle orbments are personal devices that link with their user and can produce a variety of effects. They can improve your physical abilities and allow you to cast orbital arts, among other things. But this is the newest model. The Arcus 2. It has a few additional functions. Interesting. It's a little different from the Enigma models in Crossbell. Oh man, what is your voice actress? To be precise, they are the product of a collaboration between the Reinford Company and Epstein Foundation. I want to say on, but I don't know if that's true. I assume these models are combat ready? Yeah. It'd be kind of weird I'll if they weren't. How they work. Now, each of you take one of these. Rain handed a Master Quartz to each of his three students, but he kept the we best one for himself, quartz. right? Right? The Enigmas did have these. The basics should be the same. Go ahead and set your Master Quartz in the central slot. Yes, sir. Uh, here? I should set mine while they're at it. Uh, Orbments! We know all this. Uh, is there anything new? Doesn't look like it. Do we keep in focus for ourselves? Looks like it. What happened to my master level focus? Or was it force? 
Focus was the broken one, right? Give me both of them. Actually, no. Give me the one that... The delay. Give me the delay one. Please set me... Okay. Sure. Can I save? Oh, thank God. That is it for this episode. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time.